With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, welcome everyone. So in this question, we have been given that yx is the solution of this differential equation and this is given and we have to check this option. So let us first solve this differential equation. This is dy by dx plus 2x plus 1 over x multiplied by y is equals to minus 2x. So note this that this is an equation of this type. Function of x, y and here we have some function of x. So for solving such equation we use integrand method. So what is this? So first we calculate if which is equals to e to the power integration of this and our final differential equation becomes y into if is equals to integration of if into px plus some constant c. So this is our final differential e equation. So see this is of this form. So let us solve using this. So first we have to find if. So if can be given by integration of this function. So this function is 2 plus 1 over x dx. So calculating this, we can get that it is equals to 2x plus ln x. So this can be written as e raised to the power 2x into e raised to the power ln x. So replacing e by x, so this can be given as e 2x into this will be x. So we have x e to the power 2x. So this will be our if. So our final differential equation looks like this. So this will be y into x e to the power 2x is equals to integration from if. If is x e raised to the power 2 into our px is given by e raised to the power minus 2x and some constant c. So note that this this is gone. So from here we got that i into x raised to the power 2x is equals to integration of x is x square by 2 plus c. So now for calculating c, we will use this. So we have been given that y of 1 is equals to e minus square by 2. So y of 1 is given as e raised to the power minus 2 by 2. So using this, this will be when x is 1, y is this. So y value is this and x is 1. So we got this as this. So x is 1, so 1 over 2 plus c. So note that this is gone. This can be cancelled. So from here we write that 1 by 2 is equals to 1 by 2 plus c. So from here we can write that c is equals to 0. So our final differential equation becomes that y into x e raised to the power 2x is equals to x square by 2. So for the solving this, so this x x cancel, we can write that this is equals to x by 2 and e raised to the power minus 2x. So this will be our final differential equation. Now we have to check the options. So the options is y of log e2 is equals to. So let's find y of log e base 2 is equals to. So putting x equals to log e2 by 2, we got that this is equals to this. So from the log property, I'm taking this minus 2 here. So this will be equals to log e by 2 this will be e log e this will be 2 raised to the power minus 2. So from the log property we can further write that this is equals to I am replacing this e by this. So this will be equals to into 2 minus 2 and log e e will be 1. So from here we can write that this will be equals to log e base 2 this is 4. So by 8. So this will be our option. So let, let us check. So log e2 by 8. So both these options will be incorrect. So for that we have to check that yx is decreasing in these intervals. So let us check decreasing of this function. So we have y is equals to x by 2. This is e raised to the power minus 2. So for checking uh, increasing or decreasing, let differentiate this function. So differentiating this function dy by dx will be given by, I am taking this half out and 
applying product rule so this will be x keeping this constant and differentiating this so this will be minus 2 e raised to the power minus 2 and keeping now e raised to the power minus 2 constant and differentiating this this will be 1 so this will be our differentiation so now equating this as 0 so so this will be half i'm taking e raised to the power minus 2 common so we got that this is equals to minus 2x plus 1 so equating it to 0 will give us that c exponential function is never 0 so this will can be never 0 so the this function should be 0 so equating that 2x minus 2x plus 1 is equals to 0 so from here we got that x is equals to 1 by 2 so now let's check the number line that this is half and let's put some value greater than half so putting some value greater than half in this equation so putting 3 by 4 since 3 by 4 is greater than 1 by half so putting 3 by 4 here so this equation will be half into this is e raised to the power 2 into 3 by 4 so note that exponential function is always positive so this term is positive and we have this as minus 2 into 3 by 4 plus 1 so this is equals to minus 1.5 plus 1 so this is a negative so positive positive into negative so we got this whole term as negative when we put some value greater than half so this will be negative and if we put some value less than half so this will be positive so putting 0 so 0 we got that this is positive and this we have as positive so putting 0 this will give us positive so we got that at uh, greater than half we have this function as dy by dx is negative so decreasing and for dy by dx greater than 0 we have increasing so for less than half we have increasing so let us check the option so the option c is yx is decreasing in 0 to half 0 to 1 so we know that it was half here and it was increasing here and decreasing here so this option is also wrong so d option is y x is decreasing in 1 by 2 to 1 so from here we can tell that it is increasing so d will be our answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today